here I want to appear over here how to do this you need to ch choose the player startup marker let's talk about the markers switch to the marker tab player startup when I'm gonna I left click on it and now I have in my mouse with this I can place it I can place few for the multiplayer in this case I'm gonna place just one with the left click it's gonna place the entity and right click to delete it and now I'm gonna appear here okay so I'm gonna run to the machine gun let's talk about the lights I'm gonna put the red light here and the lap I'm gonna have the green light blue light let's say let me go ahead and real fast test that I'm gonna test game button it's gonna execute it in a seconds and I'm gonna see some lighting then we, I'm gonna talk how to edit that light edit the position of the light how to move the entity position pick up the entity and move and replace the positions I'm gonna talk about some physics and I'm gonna be done for this tutorial and also I'm gonna show you how to save the project and how to do the okay as you can see we have no lights anymore after you putting the light on a 3d canvas it's gonna remove the defaults in every room I have the red here I'm gonna run and I have blue here okay you can see enemies can pursue you nice okay escape to quit it to return to my FPS creator editor okay let's say I want to move this guy I'm gonna put my mouse over it left click on it and now I can move the position with the R I can rotate it and place it with the left click of my bot and mouse but then the other guy is here it's just copying it the same guy I can build million of them uh, I can place this guy here and then we'll do another one how to get rid of this guy I need to click the right click of my bo mouse button okay so that's how you copying your entities and now let's talk about some physics uh, let's talk actually how to adjust the light as you can see everything was saying dynamic it's gonna do some action into the your game like you can kill it it's gonna blow or it can give you some damage everything with a static it's not gonna move it's just gonna do one sim simple function okay we're gonna put mouse over the light we're gonna click right click on it it's gonna bring us to some properties of it we can name it we can if we're gonna choose the static mode yes or no we can adjust it make it 200 adjust the color apply the changes okay and I just make my light not that bright so you already know how to change the properties same thing in the entity put your mouse over the entity right click and adjust the uh, health of it damage whatever you like okay and the next thing what let me talk about let's talk about the physics entities add new entity let's go furniture A let's put some creature create F here and let's put some explosive create A by the windows I'm gonna show you some physics let's, let's execute it I click test game it's gonna execute the game so we can preview it in real time real fast I'm gonna show you some physics 
you can move the objects you can destroy them and you can make some damage to the explosions too to yourself and to the environment and enemies okay let's click OK okay as you can see our light is not that bright anymore I can shut the boxes, I can jump on them, and I can do some explosions. Nice physics. Give me some damage too, by the way. Okay. So we just talk about the most techniques in the FPS creator and we talk about some concepts of the 3D gaming so you're already ready to build your own games and jump forward if not check my advanced tutorial so I will teach you how to advance your knowledge and move forward in FPS creator to create professional uh, levels and some multiple level games okay let me teach you how to uh, what is quick preview if you will click on quick preview you can preview some levels some piece of level real fast you can just render it I can show show you how whatever is your mouse is let me escape it let's say here I want to preview it here select some entity here and I will click on preparing preview is gonna put me right uh, it's not actually I need to zoom in to that piece and then click quick preview so it will put me to this piece immediately and I can preview how it's gonna look like but as you can see I cannot see that red light so there is no lighting system here that's why it's fast on rendering and there is no action okay you can use this when you're building your level design and without the lights and some action escape to quit that level and by file save as you can save your project and come back to it later and by file build game you can set the controls for your game level settings and game over images blah 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 textures and nice computers and suck computers you can s if it was multiplayer you can set some options here and then build game the the folder where the game gonna be built it and the executable file if you will click it will run and you can record this to the CD and give it to the friends and have some fun okay and this I'm gonna stop my tutorial my name is Alex Morose and uh, thank you for watching I record this tutorial with ultimate video capture which is beautiful recorder it can record your desktop it can record some game games direct X open GL can record some videos you can post it on YouTube you can share it sell it whatever you like it just built for the tutorials so thank you so much you can find that uh, video ed, a video capture at www.mrzmedia.com as again this desktop was captured with that capture it's easy to use it's very convenient and just twenty nine dollars for a full version have a good night have a good morning have a good day thank you so much and I will see you in my next tutorials good luck